Okay, guys, we have another uh, video of the challenge uh, gangs of uh, Veridia, where you have to use uh, commanders of different races. Statman is banned and fight uh, heroes, just die. And uh, the oh, <laughs> outbreak. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Moment, I forget what was the mutator the the another one so I had uh, also replay from uh, I also had replay from uh, Andalorian doing semi solo as he usually does doing uh, Zagara and Vorazun and it was interesting because he used <coughs> because the uh, Yedrex and Judas uh, already used Vorazun it was keeper of shadows so he actually used spirit of respite but as we already had Warazun, I uh, opted to for this replay. This time we have Yedrex again, but instead of Judas, we have uh, uh, KG, and he's playing as Scourge Queen. Now. Um, Let's speed it up a bit. So we have Artanis, which is uh, interesting. Artanis is actually not one of the best against the uh, heroes, but uh, we'll see. So uh, he actually plays uh, Nexus Legate, which is interesting. But yeah, if uh, I mean, he it will be uh, he will be pretty static, but uh, more power, more damage because with uh, with the Warp Haste Mastery, every time the the power field is. Uh, uh, projected I mean uh, uh, removed and uh, projected uh, on the other location warp haste will kick in again as if units were freshly morphed so it's a 60 percent 60 percent uh, increase okay, he also has of course energy master because there's a lot of energy and uh, guardian shell because uh, shield overcharge also costs energy so uh, <coughs> You don't want to waste energy on shield overcharge, you want guardian shell. Otherwise, it's kind of always better to use uh, shield overcharge because ex guardian shell is amazing, but it's a very existence that 50% extra life is not so important. Okay, let's see Raynor. Raynor's uh, penetrating. Uh, it does 300 damage. Oh, I thought it was less. Okay. But Zergling save Zergling evasion mastery. Let's see if they... Oh, I can... Oh, oh yeah. No top bars for Zagara. Okay. But yeah, Beyond Baneling uh, attack damage. Okay, so you can see how fast. Okay, it's plus two, but... Uh, but you, sti you can still see how fast they are uh, attacking. Okay, now this will be without uh, heroes, so uh, KG is going back. Okay, now the outbreak thingy. Okay, that's enough zerglings and banelings to deal with the thing. Hey, yeah, as you can see the mastery. And now let's see if there are any upgrades, not yet. Uh, it should be Zergling upgrades. Attack speed and uh, armor reduction. Uh -huh, that's... Uh, oh, 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 come on, you need to deal with these guys. Okay, he has two spines, that's okay. Now what I would do here is add some buy, buy launchers that would be really good against the uh, outbreak. Maybe later, of course, first to probably zergling upgrades. Now we have uh, this carrot. You should always prioritize uh, these uh, crystals on the low ground to actually get them home because uh, lava sweep sweeps them away.
Okay, so now uh, Mederic saved the uh, solar bombardment for the uh, hero wave, which is good because if you can like keep them in place here, this solar bombardment will do a lot of damage to them. <coughs> I have to check on Magura's map if these uh, heroes actually do less damage than the grenade and I don't know why did I think that it deals like just 100 damage and or maybe it's on the ne next scope like that I'm not sure but it is understandable a deal more like that would be as for this mutator, Ooh. okay, he actually went here, probably to defend this base from outbreaks, but now, now they have to defend against this. Okay, if you don't clear this base, the wave is always come from this side, but all, they also have wave from this side incoming now. Okay, so yeah, some outbreaks, so the cannons on the way over here. Here, ooh, 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 this is, uh, yeah, is not in position. And okay, there are no heroes here. Okay, good thing is Chrono on these to... Uh, Chrono on these to have more uh, Bane links. Okay, Scourge are not so required, it's a Roach Ravager, so... Uh, no need Chrono Scourge Nest, but... Uh, yeah, Chrono for upgrades on spawning pool and Chrono on Bane Links because it gives more Bane Links. Ooh, stop, stop, stop. Okay, good. Paying attention. Our uh, Dragoons are pretty good. They do a decent damage. Even to non-armored, but uh, the the shield region is pretty good. Okay, KG is going here. I mean, he can do it alone. It's no, it's actually not. Uh, okay. Okay, now hero away. Okay, that's a lot of bane links, so they could actually soften the heroes up. I still think it's not enough bane links to actually kill the heroes because you need a shit ton of them to kill, especially if they have double lives. Okay, over here we have Zeratul. Okay. I cannot see Zeratul is cloaked, but you can see void armor, so Zeratul provides like uh, shield that absorbs up to 100 damage. To his comrades, so there is Kerrigan, there is the Haka. Oh, there is, uh, wait, Zeratul Nova, Kerrigan, Artanis, and the Haka. Okay. So now, okay, let's observe this fight. Okay, oh, these buildings are actually softening them up uh, pretty much. Uh, now thing is, oh, Artanis, ah, z okay, armor negated, okay, Dragoons, okay, Dragoons only now join, okay, um, the thing is, uh, okay, now the, the shields also, oh, this, uh, this was actually kind of awkward fight because now they, they have to fight both wave, this hybrid is still alive, hybrid dominator, and also these guards over here, so there's more units they have to fight. But uh, now I would actually uh, uh, be glad if he actually transferred these guys earlier, but, but there are still uh, some zerglings, because zerglings are, in this con scenario, zerglings are good to have when they actually keep uh, heroes busy and then the dragoons are ranged. 
But what uh, Andalorian did, he actually kind of made a mistake that when he was playing a semi solo with Vorazun and uh, Zagara, he actually mixed Zerglings in, and Zerglings were just reducing surface area. So uh, less, uh, less, uh, void, uh, less Dark Templars and Shadow Guards could attack heroes. So then, and then it took them, it took him uh, a lot longer to kill them. But in this case, I, I actually don't like that these dragoons kind of move away, and uh, because now the heroes are doing a lot of damage to these dragoons. But okay, it's still like uh, this shields plus guardian shell, and aberrations are really good because they can. Uh, so aberrations instead of zerglings like that's what the uh, um, Delorean should have done because he did float a lot of money. I will, you will not see that replay because I will not show every one. But I'm saying just if you use uh, Vorazun, then zergling should be uh, away. And actually uh, aberrations, aberrations are good, always good to mix in because they uh, can walk. Uh, over other units and add DPS, and they can also provide units with uh, with 50% uh, damage reduction, protective cover by aberrations. How far it stretches? Okay, not very far, like in the range of maybe uh, two of the aberrations, but it's still pretty good. Like they they are not so small, so uh, it's a lot of protection over here. That's really good thing. Unfortunately, uh, Jedrick said it, the deal was to, for him to protect the expansion and KG to protect the, uh, the main, but KG is kind of sloppy in his duties. And still no Banely, still no uh, KF. I would make a queen, spread creep over here and make a few buy launchers over here and over here. And that would help a lot against this pest, because these guys just have free reign now over the base. Okay, I believe they will not be going for bonus in this game. Okay, there is Artanis over here. Artanis has most HP and has can revive once. But only after he already exhausted his uh, normal resurgence, so uh, he's kinda... Doesn't have... 8000 has... Uh, I mean, doesn't have... Uh, 16,000, only 12,000 effective HP that you have to chew through. Okay, uh, and yeah, now he's uh, now Redrick said that he needs some cannons over here. Okay, let's speed it up because I'm really hungry and uh, I pretty much said most things I wanted here. As an observer, and now they have uh, okay, they have five more. No, no, no uh, four more after these guys are at home. Ooh, that was a uh, that was pretty bad. Okay, guardian shell actually kicked in. It is uh, Artanis. Uh, no, they are they are mostly just biological, semi heroic, and uh, some of them are light, but they are no armored, so dragoons don't do so much damage. But they still, I mean, even uh, with warp haste, even this uh, 21 damage and attack speed, as you can see, almost uh, almost down to one. So that's with the, that this many dragoons, they can actually do a lot of job. Yeah, this, there is no way Static D alone can can handle double life aberrations now when they start coming, so uh, that will be a problem. This cannons we're gonna see. Uh, lava doesn't damage Amon's units. Yeah, it's a lot of abs. <coughs> this point, abs are actually more problematic than uh, heroes because they come to come more often and then come from multiple sides. Because there are structures all over the place, so they can they can spawn from here, from here, from even from here. K 
Okay, do we have heroes? No, heroes are not present here, it seems. Okay, now dragoons are coming. He doesn't want to use uh, solar because solar is safe for, for heroes. Yeah. Which is understandable. Few cannons here, still no buy launch. Yeah, KG is uh, kinda lazy. He's just a uh, moving queen here. Here it's uh, okay, he did spread creep over here. But yeah, buy launchers. Yeah, there's a lot of cannons here, but uh, like four or five bow launchers here would be a uh, uh, really good. Instead, he's just pushing in. Guardian shields. Oh, 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 oh that's uh, yeah, that's pro okay. This these guys will uh, keep these abs at bay. Okay, he also forgot the out. He didn't. He's getting at least plus three. And yeah, now we'll have heroes coming uh, where? Oh no, they will, they will be they will be going back. Okay. Oh yeah, that's good because they'll stay here, so this will do a lot of damage to them. Because they they are now waiting for the lava, so they will, uh, it's keeping them in place. And most uh, non-heroic stuff will or, or all non-heroic stuff will will die here. Okay, that's that is observer. Okay, that's that's too late. That's too late. Should have been a lot, a lot, a lot earlier. And now bonus actually revived. Okay, now heroes are coming here. I think that's only maybe. Is it only second life? Not sure. Okay, two Raynors, but also two Kerrigans. Oh, oh, oh. Guardian shell is amazing for Zagara. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yeah, without Guardian shell, all of this would be dead. Uh, this uh, carry against Apocalypse. Probably he didn't see it. Okay, KG is again a bit sleeping on the job. Now these abs are wreaking havoc over here. Luckily, just this thing has to come home. There's still heroes over here. I mean, there are, those are new ones. Ooh, 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 ooh. It's a lot of. Okay, is he waiting for bonus? He just wants to kill. Yeah, that's uh, that army is actually dying. Okay, it's these dragoons over here. But what's he waiting for? Is just this crystal? Ah, he wants to do it. Okay, okay, okay. That's now, I believe, GG. Okay, that's it. Yeah, buy launchers would be good here. And another thing, what would be good here is corruptors. A few corruptors. Because you corrupt the heroes and then, then you receive 30% more damage. So that's the thing. Some corruptors would be good to add. 35% more damage. That's pretty significant actually. So, uh, yeah. And I was showing this on stream. Uh, uh, Jedrex was molding about KG not doing this job and protecting the base. Okay, it was kind of, uh, it was good, uh, maybe a few zealots would be good to whirlwind through these uh, ro roaches and ravagers, but okay, I mean, it was fair enough by Yadrex, but uh, uh, KG should definitely have made some, uh, um, I think how good would actually Mother of Constructs be here, I think it would be good because Frenzy would be okay and also then cheap aberrations uh, to always walk over dragoons and provide them armor. I think that could be good. Uh, and definitely some buy launchers to protect from the and more static different to protect from these aberrations and in, before that from the infested uh, 
troopers. Okay, let's pause the replay. Okay, I'm gonna pause. Here we go. Kg more APM, of course, because uh, all of this APM is just morphing, uh, just making zerglings, morphing them into bane links. But uh, okay, 77 lost dragoons, but in this kind of long game, it's okay. Okay, he still killed most heroes, but okay, Kg did. Uh, did uh, kill damage wise, they might have even be even uh, considering how many banelings uh, KG spent on these uh, uh, on uh, these heroes. Okay, the Garen Quidditch is early version banning attack standard uh, Scarlet Queen Master is here. We have Guardian Shell speed increase and initial maximum speed of energy. Okay, that's it, guys. Support me on Patreon if you want or need any uh, help with co op. Uh, thanks for watching and like and subscribe if you like this and uh, see you guys